What is the most underused, powerful tool for healing your body naturally? It's using the tool of visualization. When you can add visualizing into your daily routine uh, that you do for healing, then it can really transform things for you. Our mind, we know, is an incredibly powerful tool and what goes on in our mind really powerfully affects our body. We also know through research that our body doesn't know the difference if you visualize something happening or something versus something happening. Our body believes both. So can you see how this is a really powerful tool? And what's really interesting for people is I actually use it partly as an assessment tool and then to give us homework as well. But what I, what I want to know about the person is, can they visualize themselves, you know, walking pain free in nature, you know, I'm working with people with chronic issues, chronic pain. Can they visualize themselves somewhere beautiful in nature or walking uh, pain free? Lots of people I find can do that. But then when we take the little visualization and say, okay, now you've arrived at your door and you're going to walk into your home, that can be super challenging to maintain feeling that lightness and that space of their body that, you know, they're visualizing not having pain when they get back into their uh, normal daily environment. So then that becomes a really powerful tool, right? And some people can't easily, they have trouble, excuse me, they can't easily visualize themselves walking, you know, somewhere beautiful in nature or even sitting pain free. So that tells me where their, it gives me more information about where their nervous system is at in how well it's being balanced. The more our nervous system is in balance, the more the body is better able to heal itself. And this is just another brilliant tool and it's very powerful. So if we can't even imagine feeling pain-free, like if that's a big challenge, then you can imagine it's going to be probably a little bit of a longer road to get to pain-free, okay? Alrighty, so let's do this together now. Sit comfortably, you can lie down or sit down, just shut your eyes and let's visualize walking somewhere beautiful in nature and imagine your body feels light and imagine there's no pain anywhere. You can feel your feet on the ground. Your eyes are seeing something so beautiful. And maybe if this is challenging for you because visualization is challenging, just see if you get a sense, uh, a feeling, or a shift in how you're feeling right now, even if you can't, if visualizing is, is a challenge for you in general, okay? There's lots of ways to, to get there. Feelings are, are really good. And then imagine you're walking in nature, your arms are swinging, your body feels light, you almost feel like you could skip. And now you, you uh, see someone that you love and they join you in this walk and it's like, wow, could this day get any better? I'm with my loved ones. It can be one person or many people. I feel pain free. I feel light. I feel like I could literally do anything in this moment. And then your loved ones wave, they've got to go, they say goodbye. And you find this path you're on actually leading you up to your own home, to where you live. And you walk in the door to your home and you're like, wow, I still feel pain free. I feel my body. It still feels light. And you go into your regular routine. Maybe you're making your breakfast, having a shower. You're just doing the things you do each day in your environment. And I'll give you a minute or so to do this and see how, how it goes.
And if you're someone who finds it really challenging to get a good night's sleep, you can visualize falling to sleep easily. And then you can visualize waking up in the morning, looking at the clock, noticing, oh my gosh, I slept eight hours. And you feel really rejuvenated and refreshed. And now take a big belly breath into your belly. <sighs> and let me know in the comments if that was a challenge, if that was easy for you. I'd love to hear about it. Again, it can be used as an assessment tool. So if someone you know doesn't, doesn't get to this type of homework, we can reassess and do that same little uh, meditation in three months or two months and see if it's gotten easier for that person as we move them forward in their healing journey and getting that nervous system to be more balanced so that the body can better heal itself. Wonderful. If you have any comments, I would love to hear them. And pain is no joke, so use every tool you can. I highly recommend visualization of a healthy whole body with no pain or whenever it is you need to visualize. And yeah, the sky's really the limit, isn't it? The, the mind doesn't know the difference, the body doesn't know the difference. So why not give it a try? All right, have a good one. Until next week, bye-bye.